In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a hover over effect to an image using Web Starts. You can see when I hover my mouse over this image that I see this description text pop up and a little bit of an effect applied. Let me show you how I created that. The first thing I did is I added the image that I wanted to apply the hover effect to, to my page. Next, I clicked on the style brush, then chose customize style. I then go to the hover effect section and I pick a hover effect from the drop down menu. Now you can choose from about 20 different effects. You can preview the effects by clicking on the preview effect link. There you can see the effect applied on the image to your left. For this particular demo, I used Apollo. You can see what that looks like when I click on the preview effect. Scrolling down, there's a place where I enter the title of my image, and I call that living room, and then also a place to enter the description, which of course is only displayed when you hover over the image. You can also choose to remove the text altogether from an image just by checking this box. If you want to make further changes to the effect, you can edit the effect settings. You can change, for example, the color of the title and description. You can customize the color of the border that appears in certain effects. For example, you can see this blue line right here. And you can adjust the size of the font, both for the title and description. And down here, you can do things like adjust the font weight for both the title and description. Now you can also apply hover effects to photo galleries. To do that, click on apps, click on photo gallery, add your images, click insert file, Click Insert, then click the Style Brush, click Customize Style, choose your effect from the drop-down, and then additionally with a photo gallery, you can add a separate title and description for each image. And to do that, you click Edit Text. Then you can simply just go through each image, adding a specific title and description for each. So for example, When you're ready, click Finish, then you can see not only is the effect applied, but the title and description are as well. Like always, be sure to save your changes to publish them to your live website, and click on View Site to see what they look like. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to visit webstarts.com to add hover effects to your website and see more helpful videos like this.